Okay, we had some good weather roll through here in uh, South Florida. I am on my way to Palm Beach International Raceway. Um, we have a rental this morning, and then we have a rental later tonight with another group. We got about a half an hour drive to the track. We're meeting um, Lee Dennis, uh, who so far is our, our fastest GT500. He's been 10-1 at a best of 144. We recently just uh, switched supercharger pulleys and picked up about um, 60, 60 to 70 more horsepower. It, it depends on how exactly uh, we're gonna handle the cold air kit uh, for this setup. But anyway, uh, that's enough talking. We'll see you at Palm Beach International Raceway. Okay, I'm gonna hop in Lee's car because, uh, you know, we're trying to push this thing to the limit. Uh, sorta, I mean, we're putting me in there because I'm only 170-ish pounds and Lee's, I don't know, 240, 250. Uh, but uh, we have over half a tank of gas and the passenger seat and all that. So I guess maybe we should uh, make up our mind and go all out or not. But anyway, I'm gonna hop in the car right now and we're gonna see uh, see what it see what it does with me. surprise uh, we're at about 880 horsepower right now with this setup um, and it just didn't like it so I'm gonna pull some power on launch and just like get it to make a full pass and then you know we'll, we'll have something to work with right now I have nothing to work with Much better okay uh, it felt like it almost shut the car off and bogged to 2200 1860 foot but that is still the new record mile an hour record for a GT 500 obviously that's gonna be broken over and over again but uh, we're still gonna take it uh, we've got a lot more time left to test so we, we're, we'll start feeding the power in a little bit at a time for each hit and then you know hopefully we can get that nine second pass don't forget we're on Toyo tires radio uh, regular radials not drag radials stock blower stock throttle body um stock air kit other than a filter so uh you know this is we're just scratching the surface here people so let's see what we can do on this next hit Exactly what this car is all about okay now 
Um, obviously, you know, there's way, my own car. I, I put carbon seat in it. Um, I'm going to lighten my car up. Lee's car is not light at all. I even made a pass with his McDonald's cup in here. I was driving it. That's the only weight reduction ever. And it's just because Lee is so, such a huge burly man that uh, <laughs> we wanted to not, what do you weigh, Lee? 265. 265. So it's about an 80, 90 pound weight reduction with me in the seat. But uh, I'm not that light. I'm only, uh, I'm over 170 pounds. But anyway, I'm going to do a quick walk around with this car to kind of show you that uh, what we're dealing with. And we're 100% full weight. It's stock minus these mods. Toyo R88 tires, 2.5 pulley, ID 1050X, pump E85. We're going to be testing some better E85 in it soon. Uh, did I miss anything? Uh, the lethal track exhaust. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to walk around the car right now and show you a little bit more about it. Okay, there you go. We're riding with the laptop. We got the drink in there. We got camera equipment in the back. All this stuff was in the car with me while I was making the pass. So we have over a half a tank of fuel. Um, let's go ahead and look under the hood. Uh, pretty much the only modifications under the hood are the supercharger pulley and the K2 air filter. Uh, we are leaving the lid off the cold air kit. It definitely helps. Um, and then, uh, you know, that's basically it, E85, 1050X. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and make some changes and make another hit and see what we can do. I just got a phone call from the starting line, 974 at 144 on regular radio tires, Toyo R88s, 888s. I, I'm so excited, I can't even tell you. I'm, I'm in manual mode still. Hold on a second. All right, anyway, that is manually shifting it in track mode with no traction control on a uh, non-drag radial. Uh, some very uh, extreme finesse needed in the tune to get it to uh, leave like that. Anyway. Uh, let's see what the time slip is. Uh, here we go. Give me the time slip. Where's the time? I know what it went. Give me the time slip. I already know. Jared called me. Oh. Haha, <laughs> suckers. 974 at 144. 15660 foot on regular radials. We're going to call that good for this tune up. Thank you. 